Hey guys, Rex here. Welcome back. And today I've got something pretty interesting to show you, and that is passive monsters. So, what this basically is, is any monster uh, if you're choosing, uh, it doesn't work with certain monsters, but I'll explain why later. Um, and they basically act exactly like a passive mob. So, this zombie here, he'll walk around, he'll just do nothing. But, if I go in here, he's not going to attack me. He's not tied to anything. If I push him around, he won't won't attack me. He's not he's, there's, he's not tied to anything. It's not, I'm, I'm not invisible. I don't have any potion effects. And, but he will attack me if I step right into the center of him sometimes. I don't know. Yeah, like that. Um, but if you just don't really poke his face, he won't attack you. And how I managed to do this was, I'll show you with my MBT edit mod that I'll have in the description. Um, in attributes, um, all monsters have a attribute called generic.followrange, which is how far you need to be away for them to see you, and basically all I did was set this to zero. I don't know what that is. <laughs> um, set this to zero, so basically he will not see you unless you're zero blocks away, which means you have to be right in between. Um, like right inside of him. And then over here I have a skeleton. I'll just show you he's not shooting me. Come in here. He won't shoot me. Um, it works with basically all mobs except for does not work with creepers. Um, I'll go into creative here and I'll show you. I don't know what mobs we have. Creeper, nope. Skeleton, yes. Spider, yes. Zombie, yes. Slime, yes. But uh, yeah, they'll, if it's a big slime, then it's easier for the, you to be inside of it. Uh, Ghast, I haven't tested it, but it should work. Zombie Pikman, yes. Enderman, yes. Case Spider, yes. Silverfish, yes. Blaze, yes. Yes. I'm not sure. <laughs> yes. And then these are all, um, what do you call them? Passive mobs. And a bat is sort of, I don't know, I, I should really try it with a bat, because bats are really annoying, but I don't see why, or you would need this, like, what you use it for, but it might be useful and stuff. So the last thing I'm going to do is show you that it does not work with a creeper. Well, he won't follow me or anything, but if I get near him, he will blow up. Um, and if you walk away, he won't stop blowing up for some reason. Um, so yeah, that's a s simple trick here that I discovered that you might want to use in an adventure map or something similar. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like. And if you like watching my videos, don't hesitate to subscribe. But thanks for watching, guys. Rex out.